So this video shows how the seismic event uh, will affect your racking system. And note that there are liquids within this racking system, which it causes even more seismic energy to be going horizontally. It's the horizontal energy that does the most damage in a racking system because it's designed to hold vertical energy and support it. But when the horizontal and side to side energy starts to happen, you'll start to see that uh, the system gets overloaded and it will collapse. However, in most seismic areas, your racking system should be engineered to withstand any of these kind of forces. Perhaps they didn't confer with their engineer that it was okay to store liquids within their seismic zone on that type of racking system. So it's critical, again, to make sure that you follow your engineering. That was the priming event that may have led to the major trigger of a seismic event or earthquake of taking out this racking system. So you can see how the combination of these two caused these events to happen.